This is an amazing testimony. This family has been touched so powerfully by God. Their young boy, Caleb, this is the father, this is the stepmom. He had two brain tumors and a hole in the heart. He was scheduled for a doctor's appointment. He came to the revival service the evening before the appointment. This is the boy with the... This the is the boy who we talked about last week. The power of God touched him. He went to the doctors the next day. He's since been for two appointments. Each time the doctor has said, there is no trace of cancer whatsoever. <laughs> The power of God's getting so strong up here right now. Mama, come, 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 bro. Tell us, tell us in full detail. I want to hear the whole story. Don't you miss one little detail. Okay. No pressure. Okay. On March the 17th of last year, he was diagnosed with a supercellar germinoma, which is uh, a very rare cancer, you know, with, it was two brain tumors. One was small and one was very large. He had surgery on March the 23rd, I believe, because he also had fluid built up around his brain where the, the tumor was blocking it. And he's went through radiation, he's went through chemo, and one of the, the small tumor had shrunk a little bit, but they had gotten through everything and said, you know, at one point there was nothing else that they could do for him. Praise God that we had doctors that would not speak negatively in his life, so we don't know how far things could have been. We just know that they said there was nothing else that they could do for him. We've been having everybody pray for him, and this kid has been telling us that God is going to heal me. Jesus is going to heal me. I'm the kid. I know this. Why don't y'all know this? Y'all are the adults. And then we brought him last Thursday. <laughs> and I heard you call out that God was healing a brain tumor. And I knew it right then. I knew it was him. And the next morning, he got brought to the doctor for his pre-scheduled MRI. God knows, doesn't he? God had already had it set up. That um, MRI was the ne very next day. And it showed no trace of a tumor. <laughs> None. <laughs> The first doctor was amazed. She said that there was, it was gone and there was never no trace of it having been there. This was his cancer doctor. And I had to take him back to his neurologist earlier this week, I believe. And she even said too, she said, well, she said, there's no more tumor there. And she said, if I hadn't personally known about it, she said, I would have never been able to tell that it was there. And Come on, give Jesus some praise. Hey, Caleb, are you happy? Yes. Are you, could you tell us what Jesus has done? He healed me, and then I can play sports now. 